हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू थ्री डी लाइट दिस इज द क्विक अपडेट ऑन पी ई टी फिलामेंट मेकिंग मशीन इन दिस वीडियो आई विल शो हाउ टू प्रिपेयर प्लास्टिक बॉटल फॉर मेकिंग स्ट्रिप्स यूजिंग डिफरेंट मैथड बेस्ड ऑन द अवेलेबल रिसोर्स एंड ऑल्सो हाउ यू कैन मेक यूज ऑफ रैम्स वन पॉइंट फोर बोर्ड्स टू कंट्रोल नोजल टेम्परेचर फर्स्ट लेटस सी हाउ यू कैन प्रिपेयर बॉटल लाइक दिस टू गेट इवन स्ट्रिप्स For this you will need to attach bicycle tube valve with the bottle cap as shown here. Don't worry if you do not have one. I have also shown other method in later part of the video. You can use epoxy based adhesive to make it leak proof. Next you will need a heat gun and a bottle. Attach the cap on the bottle. Now slightly pressurize it by using pump. Then move the bottle over heat gun. Remember to use hand glove and other safety devices. Now the bottle is shaped evenly. before opening the cap be careful it might blow off the cap and possibly hurt someone or something Achha. luckily we were saved the first time this was not recorded akka <laughs> the problem with this method was to rotate the bottle manually so i tried using drill to rotate the bottle I have made simple attachment from nut and bolt so that it can be fixed into a drill chuck. You can also use adhesive here to make it leak proof. The bottle's outer surface has become smooth but it is not so uniform because of lack of pressure inside. Since the attachment was not made leak proof but it has not made much difference in the strips and eventually the print quality it is good to have even strips so make sure you have a leak proof attachment the most simplest and accessible way is by using gas stove this was already shown in previous video on pet machine Now cut the bottom bottle portion and insert it into the stripper. Pull the strip at uniform rate. Here is the strip. It came out nice as expected. Here is my upgraded version of the machine. Now instead of using REXC 100 temperature controller, I have used stock extruder nozzle with 1.5 mm hole without changing the temperature sensor. This is connected directly to RAMS 1.4 board as we connect in any 3D printer. Since RAMS supports two extruder If you are running your printer on RAMS 1.4, then you can use one for the PET make filament making machine and other for printing. Let me know if you want a video on how to configure Marlin for two extruder in the comments. Now let's make filament. Cut a thin strip and insert it into the nozzle. Set the temperature to 210 degrees Celsius. Start pulling the strip when temperature reaches about 150 degree. Then attach it to the motor.
here is our strip ready for 3d printing make sure to check my earlier video for more details This is the first sample print. Let me know in the comments what do you think about the print quality. Thanks for watching guys. Give your feedback through like, dislikes and comments. Please like, subscribe, share if you find it useful. Bye bye. See you in the next video. Thank you.